would like to welcome our loved ones and honor guests. We are gathered here to join Albert and Pamela in the spiritual union of marriage. They knew each other in high school, but they didn't talk. And it wasn't until Albert saw Pam years later at a pool hall and asked her if he could buy her a drink. So his courage in that drink led us to where we are today. When her and Bert started dating, she also gave me a new best friend who I also could depend on and trust with my whole life. And there's nobody I'd rather hand my sister off to than Bert. When he met you, Pam, trust me, he fell hard for you. She fell really hard. All he ever wanted to do, Pam, was to be with Pam. The more time he spent with you, the more you guys became inseparable. The only thing Albert said is, she wants to hurry up and marry me. But honestly, I think it was Albert who wants to hurry up and marry her. From this day forward, I ask you to share in my life and in my dreams. I will communicate to you in my thoughts and my feelings, and I will comfort you. Then I will comfort you in time of need, through happiness or sadness, sickness or health, wealth or poverty. I ask that we stand together through mistake and grow together safe, through each experience we share, for as long as we both shall live, for as long as we both shall live. Take this ring as a symbol of my love and fidelity. Take this ring as a symbol of my love and fidelity. Nothing can stop this man from being where his heart belongs, and that is with you, Pam. Now, Pam, I just want you to know, and I want to say one thing to you. You're family now. That means you got all of us to depend on. Albert, will you have Pamela to be your wedded wife, to live together in this holy estate of matrimony? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsake all others? Keep yourself only unto her so long as you both shall live. I do. Pamela, will you take Albert to be your wedded husband, to live together in holy estate of matrimony? Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, and forsake all others, keeping yourself only unto him so long as you both shall live? I do. <laughs> By the authority invested in me in the state of California, I now pronounce you husband and wife, you may kiss your bride.